So I've lived in Arizona since I was in junior high school, and, and my rule of thumb is that you leave your community better than how you found it. When I went to the legislature, I was a young mom, and I could see that uh, many families were struggling with making certain that their children got what they needed. You know, the neat thing about the legislative process is you learn with every issue that you take on. And that's really reflective of my experience at the legislature. I worked a lot on prenatal care issues, on issues of health care and prevention. I worked on, as I said, early childhood issues because these are the formative years. In 1989 and 90, there had been a terrible measles outbreak in the country. And I think the science community was really surprised by the fact that there was as much disease spread because there was a vaccine, and that's when TAPI was created. I got involved in 1996, three years into the project. But then came the challenge of not only retraining physicians to make certain that when children came into their office, that somebody was looking to see if they were up to date on their shots. And then the technology side kicked in. Physicians said that they didn't have enough information to do a good job of keeping kids up to date. So Arizona decided to develop an immunization registry. I'm always excited to hear about new medical innovations. And I love the fact that there are new vaccines in development. And uh, to me, the opportunity to prevent disease is, is very, very important, and I want to see more development. I really have enjoyed the expansive development of our bioscience environment that have enhanced the health of our community. And the more you learn, the more you see where you can find a place to make a difference.